Hi, I'm Kate. Welcome back to PageFly Video Tutorials. In today's video, we will guide you how to use HTML PageFly video elements. Videos offer a dynamic way to convey information, making your content more memorable and impactful. Now here we are in PageFly Page Editor to add a normal video to the page. By clicking on the Elements icon on the left toolbar here, scrolling down a bit you can find the HTML element. Now, just need to drag and drop the element into your editor. Easy, right? Now, let's start with the general tab settings. There are two ways to update the HTML video source in PageFly. First, click the reselect button here and drag your video into the dotted line area. Or use the add video button to upload a video from your computer. The second way is to upload your video to Shopify files and copy the URL by clicking this icon. Then return to the page fly editor, click the add video from URL icon and paste the video URL. Do you think it is all done now? There are two ways you can change the size of your video. Full width, the video will display at its full width. Custom size, the video width option allows you to choose the video's width. These are the show controls. By selecting or deselecting this option, you can decide whether to reveal or conceal the video player control. Turn on this option if you want the video to run in a loop. Turn on this option to make the video autoplay. Please note that this option for autoplay to work on live view. When you open the page and turn on this option to mute the video, you can select an HTML video cover image by clicking this button In the Styling tab, you have a variety of parameters to customize the slide. Styling tab allows you to customize the spacing, border, and others of the HTML video. By using spacing, you may align the HTML video in the center of its container. You can specify a number in the center margin to center the HTML within its container. The area surrounding the video would increase with the number. Additionally, Whenever you desire, give your HTML video a border, add borders to your HTML to give it greater prominence and help it stand out from other parts. Three border styles are available by default, solid, dotted, and dash. And voila, let's publish the page and see it in live view. Click save. And when save is done, you will see a publish button. Click on it. Here you are. Just keep in mind, the file size must be less than 10 megabytes and only supported video formats or MP4, WebM, and AUG. This is the end of the tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe our channel to get more videos. Our friendly and knowledgeable team is available via live chat 24-7 to assist you with any issues. Thank you for watching.